hey this is driving with the miles how do you pull out of a fast food place so we're coming up to the edge the driveways are very narrow this place is brand new so you want to be careful you're thinking about your food you think about sticking french fries up in your nose but you got to be careful right because you're thinking about your food and you're hungry so you're coming up to the edge of the road i look left I look right, I look left, I make sure the food is secure, and then you turn hand over hand into the nearest lane, turn into the nearest lane, and then you turn out hand over hand. And then obviously the speed limit here is 50 miles an hour, so I'm gonna go ahead and get up to about 35, 37, 42 miles an hour, and I'm just scanning the intersection. The light's yellow, build good habits don't run yellow lights on your dnv test your road test if you run a yellow light that possibly could end up turning red that is failure also i'm behind the stop line so i lead by example if you saw the other in-car video i still have my race pages on so the oil pressure is down to 27 which is fine it pops right up my uh oil temperature is 197 degrees and my battery voltage is 14.4 so which is fine these are my g-force uh, gauges they tell how fast i'm going uh, the steering angle of the vehicle so i'm just looking straight ahead and you want to aim high i will do a mirror video i've had some requests to do that so obviously i'm just looking around taking my time being safe i'm scanning i will be making a right turn up here at the light so uh, 100 feet a half a block I'm looking over my right shoulder mirror turn signal blind side you see me scanning back to the left you have to do this on your road test I'm looking I'm scanning and then you look in the first lane and then you turn out slowly that's a pretty smooth turn your DMV tester your road tester will look for you to have really good turns there's a street coming up 100 feet a half a block I'm just gonna drive through this random neighborhood some going slow on my brakes really easy and, and then I'm turning hand over hand into the turn and then I turn out hand over hand so I'm looking I'm scanning I'm taking my time you always want to take your time in neighborhoods you always want to look you always want to scan and safety is no accident so I'm just going slow through the neighborhoods you see me looking left and right because I have uh, the in car camera and I turn on my left turn signal so I want to have a nice smooth stop I don't want to slam it you want to remain motionless for three seconds 1001 1002 1003 and then I'm turning hand over hand into the turn and then I turn out hand over hand safety is no accident um, one of my bosses used to say that but it really does make sense i'm going to make a right turn up here so my blinkers are 100 feet a half a block um i'm just under 25 miles an hour I'm taking my time the temperature is below freezing so we're not trying to hit black ice and slam into a car and then i turn back hand over hand out good speed control is critical you always want to look you always want to be aware and you always want to take your time i'm going to go ahead and pull over and uh give you guys a little summary a little closing and then we can just move forward from there so whenever you're driving you want to have good speed control you want to look ahead you want to be safe through neighborhoods you have to take your time i need you to give this a thumbs up I teach driver's education. This has been Driving with the Miles. Please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. I do appreciate you very much and what you do. Thank you so much.